My name is Dave Ham. I'm the owner of Henley Boat Manufacturing, and we build boats. Yeah, I guess about 22 years ago, I was in the business of selling boats. A chap came to see me from Picton, Ontario, and he said, have you ever thought maybe of buying a boat company or getting involved in building them? And I said, well, that thought really had not crossed my mind. So I hopped in my airplane and flew down to Picton, and lo and behold, I came back owning Henley Boats, and it worked out. I worked here with my dad for 30 years. We had a hardware business in town, and uh, we were a Honda dealer, and then we evolved into the boats. From four staff members up to 14, and uh, you can't find a better place to build boats than Mantua Island. The major challenge that we have is the swing bridge in Little Current, believe it or not. It's too damn narrow. You can only get a 14-foot boat across there, and some of the boats that we build are 16 feet wide. What do we do? Well, the next best thing to do is to stick them on the Chi Chi Mon. You know, a year ago, we built one that was 16 foot six. No good for the Chi Chi Mon, no good for the swing bridge. So what did we do? We dropped it in the water here and sailed it over to the uh, east side of Manitoulin and, and then took it out of the water with a couple of big cranes. Anything is possible if you put your mind to it. Somebody always wants something different, and we can you know, modify pretty much anything to, to suit anybody's needs. Of course, the biggest thing is trying to find laborers, workers, welders. The potential in this business alone, just here on the island, is unbelievable. But to get the qualified people in the door that are gonna stay here and do the work, that's the part that we're finding hard. So it's the ambition to put an addition on this plant. It's projected that it would hop up to about 45 employees in grand total, and we would turn into an assembly line type manufacturing system. Well, I think the need for it is, is already here. It provides a, a, a skilled trade for people to learn in the welding and metal fabrications. And we have a lot of employees from Pukwemeko, and I know the chief is fully in support of what we're doing. He said, you know, he's mentioned, How could, what can we do to help? What better thing to do than help your neighbor? For young people to come out here, it'd be great. You know, it'd be a great start. And a lot of people, they, I don't think they'd want to leave. Manitoulin is the largest freshwater island in the world. I think that, that that's quite a statement. No one else can say that. The peace and serenity, the views, clean water, not to be matched anywhere. It's a different lifestyle up here, completely. When I get in my truck, I'm at home in five minutes. I work down south and I find that it's, uh, it's like a rat race. So either you love it or you don't. And I love it out here. The potential to expand things is, is pretty much endless. It's a nice place to come and raise a family. In this particular business, I think it's onward and upward. We could put a lot of people to work.